We've done a lot uh, over the past year to two years to focus on the increasing medication adherence. Some of the things that we, we're doing is we've worked uh, very closely with our software vendor in terms of our dispensing software to get some dashboards and some report cards where we can actually show physicians what the patient's current adherence is and show the patients what their current adherence is. And that's been one of the things that I've never really uh, occurred to me is in all our work on adherence, we've been telling them, uh, you know, they need to do better with this drug or trying to engage the whole community. We, we try to engage the, the family members. We try to engage doctors, nurses, parish nurses, whoever that happens to come in contact with this patient. But the patient never really got a good sense of they're bad because we just kept saying, well, you really need to take this every day. Now we have a way we can visually show them in, in graphic form what their adherence has been over the past year or month. Um, and they look at it and they go, wow, if that's important enough for you to be monitoring, then maybe I need to do a little better about it too. So probably our software a company that we've worked with has been giving us that big giant leap from the kind of 1.0 system to the 2.0 system where we're, we're really able to identify uh, gaps in therapy. Uh, all our staff have been trained and we, we hit home with meeting after meeting on adherence and things we can do to improve adherence. And we've gone out to the physician community and let them know how big a problem it really is. They're doing everything right. They're prescribing by the guidelines, but the patient is not taking it right and the physician doesn't know that. So they don't understand why why the patient's not getting better and why the labs aren't improving and why the condition's not improving. So we've spent a lot of time out in the community telling physicians, telling other healthcare providers that adherence is not good. And by spending more money on medicine and making them more adherent, we can reduce the total healthcare cost and improve their health quality. As well as um, we've been sharing this with our pharmacy colleagues on how important we think this is and how we think that uh, this one thing for coming to the convention and, and talking about it here is how important we think this is and what this is going to mean to us in the future.